Praise the Lord. Glory. Hallelujah. Good evening to you. Welcome to Obina Show Live, the Gospel Edition. Buana sifiwe, buana sifiwe sana. Leo tunataka kucheza gospel na tuonge gospel. <laughs> Another beautiful night that we are hosting one of your favorites. For this episode, this is among my favorite gospel artists in Kenya. If not the shortest gospel artist in Kenya, is among them. Okay, nani mgina neza kwa mfuzi kumliko? Master Peter me mishinda na... Na Master Peter naimba ta gospel? <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the one and only Nisho T Baba. Yeah, man. Moji, moji. <laughs> moji. Ni aje? Wasa na kupi. Uko fiti? Niko poa, man. Karibu. Asante, man. Karibu. So happy to be here, man. Uh -huh. Big show. Big man. Karibu sana. Short guy. Two big men. <laughs> yeah, man. Two big men. No, you say big things. Some small packages. So... <laughs> <laughs> but, but, <laughs> but look at the bright side, you serve a big God. Ah, come on, come yeah, on, yeah. come on, one photo. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> When's the last time we did the Bible? Hey, my, oh my God, I haven't said it in a while. <laughs> one photo. I see, I see. Was that new evolve? Yeah, I know, I know. It's been. We look at the corner and say, ah. See how many people get show and be able to say, ah. I love one of them. Ah, I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a little change. <laughs> 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 You now, you're not Moji, short baba. It's really Nishoti. Hey, man. King Kaka was Kakasungura. Hey. <laughs> was rabbit. Hey, Kakasungura. You see, guys, I've me, I was... Say, so, you can't say that King Kaka. Yeah. Like, I'm going to say that. I'm rabbit. Yeah, yeah. rabbit. Yeah, yeah. Because Bro Angu Mdogo, Bro Angu Mdogo, I'm going to say that King Kaka. King Kaka. No, man, this was rabbit, man. Like this was the hair. Sungura. Me, mine was, you don't know. You don't know. You done no. You done no. Yeah, so ni kwana imba ni kwana inga stage. Mi ni kwana miyam say usi ni umbi watu mpige makofi. Na inga stage na fanya dance all na imba miyam so have dancers. I do choreography and everything. That was only dance all. When I finish to say, my name is MG. Say you done no. Then I talk a stage. There are people who know me from then until now. You done no. You done no. Then I evolved to Obi na Ike Igwe. Then you know, so now I'm poto. You go in India. Kito kito go kito go in India. I'm poto. Who's in India? Yeah, you say. You go around. Me only say. Eh, mtu ameka i microphone kwa kwa ndevu. Aku anu nusu yako na mandevu. Anamiskia, anamiskia abshwa. Manamiskia fiti. You go sawa. Eh, na ona Steve akona wasiwasi Steve. Wasiwasi ni ni ni. Una nongeza masavi yetu. Na ndio hata tujaza kipindi. Huyo ni katuni. Mulitaka kucheka. Wala nda kucheka sema ni. Karibu sana my brother. So let me tell you something interesting. The first time my son met you. So I think schools were closed. And my son when they closed school. He wants to experiment with his hair. Na mini ule budawa. Haya. Enda. Ndaka kama jambazi. <laughs> so he went to my barber shop yeah. where me and you we make our hair. Yeah. So he was there. So mi napigi watu simu. Mm. Na pia dad. <laughs> <laughs> so he was there with my PA. Mm. He called me. Dad. Niko hapa kwa kinyozi na moji short babako hapa nataka ni msalimi. <laughs> Anaomba rusa. No, hey. anataka ni unge na wewe. Oh. Ukupali wa kusalimi ah. wapige na wewe picha. Eh. Hey. In my I'm like, that's none of my business, man. Fight your own fight. And I want myself you new Be a man. Be a man. <laughs> <laughs> but somehow you accepted. You guys even did a video. He was so happy. Hey. So my dad, he wrote a video. Me kawa na nisha video of a shoot. I'm just like this guy. I was like, I wish. Hey. I can meet watu flani na jua. 
Sitaki kusema ni wilipo. <laughs> wilipo ze. <laughs> yeah, you utaji majina. I asked mm. jina mutu, but angejipigi o selfie peke yake. Eh. So I'm giving you your flowers. Eh. Thank you for being a good man eh. and for being a kind person. Eh. And for as long as I've known you, you've mm. always just been kind. Like yeah. I've known you since you are doing songs with the Didi man. Mm. Mm. You've always just kelele takatif. Yeah, yeah. Ni takataka deng teng taong. Buf keizo wa vitu. Ni kelele takataka. Ari mara ima mama ni kelele takataka. So mtu atashi ni takataka. 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 Kwa nini mjita takataka? <laughs> I didn't say it. Mia mesewa. Ni takataka ah, ah. tengba. So, iliko... Uh, Ata nukwambi, the thing is, eh, yeah. it's... You see, like, your, 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 your son is a yeah. good example of people who... Because I bet he listens to my music, yeah, yeah, yeah. and he jumps to it, man. Ebu imagine if that day I disappointed that boy. True. Unajua? True. Si ati dunia yake ingesi mama, but, and, like... I think it was very hard for him to consume yeah, my music. Yeah, the people never forget. Eh, like to consume never my music. Forget. Angesa how how he made him. They kuna never kuna forget. kuna an American poet said that uh, people don't forget how you made them feel. That's like very people true. people might forget sometimes something, but how you make them feel in a in a very and, important. And how you smell. Yeah. <laughs> of course you make you make them you make them feel uncomfortable if you smell. <laughs> so it's how you make them feel either by what you say Either by how you carry yourself, yeah. either by whatever, how you make people feel, if they feel uncomfortable, if they feel all those they things. So it. it's important. Now people want to say, what do you do? So come on, boy. Like, I don't know, man. 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 Na hata isa hawa watu, eh, hizo miaka zote tulipata na ngana. Jusikuizu na hata kuna kama mse mwona hapa, kuna eh, na nijemo. Yeah. Pata na yakeo very young, like 10 years ago is, minu na 10 years, kitamu nukona 10 years ikiwa such a long time. Yeah. Sa imi ubina tumejona na yo over 10 years. True, true. Ona vile tumezeka. Well, na weu kuna watoto zeka, wane, wewe. mimi goda na nisaidia tu. Miss na, Jaseka, au na watoto? Kuna spiritual sons. <laughs> Kwani baba unapiga blanks nini? Bado sijanza. Ujaanza kupiga blank samu ujaanza kuzi. Wendo umekimbia, wendo umekimbia. Ya, ah, wendo wacha umekimbia. tuonge tu maneno. Ah, ah. Umewa miaka ngapi? Iyo ote ni ya mungu. Ya, ah, umewa miaka ngapi? Two years. Ya lafo? Pole pole tu. Mamba ya mungu. <laughs> Mamba ya mungu hiyo. <laughs> Iyo kimbiza gui. <laughs> Awana semanga God helps those who help themselves. Are you, are you helping yourself? Oh, yeah, of course I am. Oh, I am. good. <laughs> Itafiki tu. Ilakini no. mbize ni kulize. Yeah. Sorry tu, off, off topic. Okay. Ukuna tutuwa ngapi? Waine. But walikuja na mama zao. Ah, yeah, shit. What's wrong, Gabi? Why One hey. boy, three girls. Ngoja. So, so, umeacha ama uendelea? Nikipata ambarei. <laughs> <laughs> Neza penda sana. <laughs> Kukua na mtoto hiyo mbeni. <laughs> Lakini ama morio wengine. <laughs> wakonza, wakonza. Hell no. Wakonza kuna mbeka ngabi? Uh, 13. What? Yeah. So, that was my first uh, experience. Uh-huh. I didn't know anything. So the mother was telling me, Ufanya hivi, inawe kwa nkwa hapa, ino hee, before you were, hee, whoa, a boy, I'm like, what? Unmin said. Thirteen. Yeah, my second born is about turn eleven, my third born just turned ten, my last born is six. Jesus Christ. Why are you blaming Jesus? It's a blessing. Okay, off camera. Hey! Okay. Salute bro. <laughs> Me have nothing but respect. I know. Eh, kama una leo watoto wanne kwa hii economy. Wewe unataka watoto? Eh, yeah. you Ataka. want children. Yeah, I'm going to get them soon. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Na tunaona tuweka. Unazuliza msema anasema mimi I've never I don't want children because also people don't want and I respect their decision. Mm. Yeah. The same I don't, I don't want children. I love I have love to give to others who are already there. Yeah. I'll adopt. Yeah. 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 I don't know man. I think kuna best yangu na stamtaja shey ni mbivo alafu the next man atakapata mtoi. So nilikuwa namchekela tu. Ni chali ama ni demo? Ni chali nilikuwa nacheka sana. Alisetiwa, alisetiwa. Ah zizi zizi. But alisetiwa huyo. Kama kwa nataka alisetiwa. I think it's amazing man. Me I am I'm the first kwa sababu ya madangu I'm the first cousin. So ni muona on my cousins wakizaliwa. Sasa hii ile furaha yenye na kujaga yani ni poa sana. You also know what not to do. Eh ni muona like what like almost like I don't know almost 20 kids yani first cousin. Kwani muna zaidi? Ah, uh, shusha wangu alikuwa na, alikuwa na eight kids. Mm. Eight kids, my, my mom is late. She was a second oh. born. So alikuwa na eight kids. So you can imagine. So seven people. How many kids do you want? How many kids do I want? As, as much as God can give me. Eh. Mm. Na hiu chumi ya smata. Unajua hizi vitu, hizi vitu, ni mikuja kurealize some of these things, um, we should be very careful in our words. Unajua asu sema, I don't want kids, I don't want kids. Because of, 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 of your current experience, of your current context yeah. of state of mind. So you say permanent things in when you're going through temporary things. <coughs> By the way, mm. 
So you say very, very permanent things or do very permanent things when you're going through a temporary feeling. So we should be very careful what we say when we, we're going through very temporary situations and then tomorrow the season changes. So now what? So two things. Either people, people, take, you, um, people take you as a liar I'm going to unnecessary pressure. True. If I come here and say, Mr. Y, Mr. Y, Mr. Y, people remember, they're here. So the day you get to me, I can't face you guys. I can't face you guys. God, Miki, to me, I promise to. I can't face you guys. I can't face you guys. Acha, acha, acha. Wow, wow. No, what are you saying? Don't say any permanent things for them. No, but you don't want to come here. I know. I guess about God. And yeah. Miki, I'm going to talk to you guys. Things might change a little bit. I tell you, my dear. You make one. I tell you, my dear. I'm going to go to my life. I'm going to go to my life. Electricity. Avoid. I'm going to go to my life. As long as you live, you'll, you'll always get into trouble. Yeah. But what you should avoid is creating, is creating trouble. Because if you create it, it's there. your... If you create it, it's Nishidayako. Like if it comes, Nishidayako here, but at least you only take it. Nishida, Nishida. No, but you know, Kuna Nishida. You can't get it. Yeah. Na kuna kupatwa kwa noma ujui? Kuna kwa kana tofauti? Okay. Kwa ukipatwa kwa noma, that's why ukipata mtu mwingine kwa noma ufai kum ufai kum kum kum, kum whatever. Yeah. Kumuingilia kwa zone unaweza kwa noma. But ufai ujiingize kwa noma we mwenyewe. Unasema tu kitu alafu baadaye inakuja na kukuramba na unajua wewe ulijua uliko unachokoza. Okay. Eh, so unafai uchunge especially as wasanii. Wasanii wana kuchokoza mafans kila siku hapa. Alafu mafans wanaanza kukutusipoa poa. Sasa una hata <laughs> Kila ukiposu na tukanwa, unogopa. So, wenu unawachokoza, alafu sasa you can't take the insults. Unawanda kusema, oh, cyberbullying. Kume ni wewe. You are the source. You are the source. Unaputa bangi. You can still plead the fifth, of which we know the answer. Sivuti bangi. But kuna futanga bangi. Apana. No, ngoma zenyu na didi man, yeah. kelele takatifu. Ah. <laughs> let's just be honest. Mm. Okay, let's start from the beginning. Muli tuwa napi na ojama? High school. Oh, you are the same high school? High school. Senior chief koinange memorial girls. Uko na tulisomea. <laughs> I kwa memorial girls. Ilikuwa memorial women. Uko like, are you there? He, she, moji, moji, they. Nzi, ilikuwa senior chief koinange high school. Okay. ilikuwa mix. Alafu si tu wakati tulingia form 1 hivyo bina wakati kwa kwa admit boys. So mimi si kwa hii monolize. So you had very few boys, boys in the and very many girls. So the demand was high. The demand was high. Lakini pia the surveillance was easy. That's the other thing. Mkikuwa kidogo pia bina. Kwa ni mwana baba ya makosa gani shule? Hapana si unajua the idea was So the thinking is kama mko 200 boys and a thousand girls that mko na madem wengi. Lakini na maanisha mko few boys. So mnaonekana so madem wenyu anajua. Where are the three men? Eh hey, hey, hey. 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 so alimo na wanini but miss atuko iko miss ko iko na like but then tuko form 4 kuko na form 2 form 3 form 1. That's how Leona mkimaliza. Eh but you must have been a beautiful baby. Well, I don't know. <laughs> Chabi round short. Can I tell you something funny? Hmm. Keja yetu ilichomeka 2007. And most of my photos nikiwa mtoto ama nikiwa 10 7 whatever zilichomeka zote so i have no i have no photos no but see, you know yourself when you don't know yourself you remember yourself as a baby oh acha mambo yako wewe why i don't <laughs> okay so atujijui kama watoto hata sasa hiyo kiambo ujitore unadhani utajitora poa <laughs> <laughs> Mimi naonyesha kwa picha moja. Hey. Imagine in my whole childhood all my siblings, mimi hapa ninajua they didn't start beating me here. Hey. All my siblings have pictures when they were children. Mm. I there's only one. Mm. One picture na akai kama mimi, mpaka anasema ah you guys just look for a photo tukufunika ibu. Sema huyu ni wewe. I'm like mbona ni kwa hiyo picha peke yangu at you this is a neighbor who used to babysit you. I'm like, Where's mom? Where's dad? There's nobody. Or maybe you are not a beautiful baby na wako nataka kukumbuka. <laughs> No, no, they were not my family. They would want me to remember that shit. <laughs> I'm like, hey, no, well, like yeah, 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 yeah. Wacha, wacha mungu msaidie huko mbele. Unajua there guys, there guys. Have you ever seen the what you call the demon night the glow up? So the glow up of of, of sana sana women. May I remember sana that? Sana sana is women. Yeah, so like you remember like high school the, 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 like there are girls you'd say you'd call beautiful and there are girls you just look at. You're like, yeah. ah, okay. Thank God for 
This. Thank God. <laughs> but now they are more fearful. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna say anything. Was but just in that, in that, in that, in that, in that context. Hey. hey, but then after high school, five so years later, they are beautiful really... girls, and then they are girls. Eh, no, can you just say if it was in a katangwa? Is it a katangwa? Katangwa, no, na moji, moji, whatever. But I'm just saying, like the glow up. Let me just say, the okay. glow up of people sometimes in a kwanga very crazy. So at all, I say like, unangata wasani, wasani unangata picha. Kasi ubi nomto kianga le picha. Kuna school kona shina. Kuna school kona shina na kofia kared mase. I know. Ushona yo kitu wasani kwambo. Indo brand ya kopsi. Ushwe to ikofia. We are likuani mimi. Then the coffee became more famous than I am. So you talk coffee, when he, Niki baby, ah! Kula siku ni meshikuwa na Ivan, she was speeding. We kaka rikando, ni 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 we ni 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 ni. Oka fun, oka tura kaka coffee. No, actually, ni kuwa nyuma kuwa speaker. Apo juu ya Ken, ni kuwa na speaker za Ken, Kenwood ama Kenwood. Yeah, Kenwood. Ni kuwa apo juu. So ila kwa fun, why drisha nyuma kwa alazma? Na hii coffee amoni na kaka coffee ya Obina. For real? Kwa ni unajua Obina? Yeah, that coffee, I was the only one who used to wear the red one with the. You still have it? Hell no. Yes. Sisi asme memory me, itako memorabilia unafaa kuwa nayo. Si kuna ma video online. Hapana hiyo sikuwa una, unaweza kuja kuuza for charity. Sio njoto hizi vitu. For charity. Yo kofia yeah. cycle mtu anaivaa. Juu ni meet up coming That particular. Hey, one. That particular one. The yeah. same. No, I changed a couple of oh, times. Is, is, is there something I if there's something nimekuja kujua saa hii. Yeah. It's that I wish I kept some things like my first rhyme book. Unuzo vitu. Oh, na ndani kuna shida. Kuna kitu kuna za iframe, kuna shida. Ndani kuna shida. Problem to you. Bro, you, you are a collector. Let me ask you. Where, where you don't see yourself, like where you are now, you don't see yourself ten times bigger. No, I am, so yes. If, no, no, Sema, like now, if, imagine now, Obina, ten years from now, twenty times bigger than he is. Atamali will go na lala. What? You should not, you should not Ethiopia and Nagamali, Haile Selassie di lala. Like, if you're ten times bigger than you are now, and whatever, and you're a legend, like, people will want to know, umse alikuwa naishu wapi. Umse alikuwa naishu wapi. Nini zilo ma ume, ume, nini. Siku na video, bro. Sala utu tukofia, una tuweka, utu tu nini, utu tu bids ulu kwa una fa. Una fa kuhu me tuweka, mze. Tuna tegele za kastachu. 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 Tuna tegele Hiyo time tulikuwa wewe unasema mimi na dini tulikuwa na mambo hivyo hivyo sio wote tulikuwa tunaonana tu unaona haya wasa wana try so in high school looking at from one how big were you big in terms body Urefu. size sikuwa tu mfupi tulikuwa eh, nini kwa tu kama kafupi kadogo watu walikuwa wana enjoy mase okay but that's all high school Kenya high school by the way sikuwa mean sana sikuwa yeah, very mean yeah but yeah. i've never understood the theory of i was bullied i have to bully someone else I've never understood it. I'm like, you do know the person you're bullying is not the one who bullied you. Like, yeah, if yeah, I was yeah. to bully someone myself, I'd look for that guy who bullied me, mm. I would give them back their dose. It's a balance of life, though. Sometimes in a kwa hivo. No. Mm-hmm. Well, Asami ni meibiwa, so nataka kuibia uyu pia. Kwa sana ipitisha hivo, ina kwa tu hivo. Kwa sana kapitisha, ni kama baton. Kwa sana kapitisha. Bona kia yuwa bona I am. But I'm saying that's what people, that's how people reason. Bona wongei kamo kona rota katifu. No. Wacha nikwame, one of the hardest things kwa hilifanyikia, bro. Kulikuwa na jamaa alikuwa head boy shule yetu. Alikuwa uh-huh. mpaya, alikuwa ananionea. Siku moja nilipatana na yeye. Yeye siku hiyo jana za beba mtu hivyo. Ilikuwa hard kusalivyo wewe mse. Kuzungu sasa alikuwa bully, alini bully vibaya. Alikuwa Al- bully vibaya ni aje. Unajua ni ushike giza wewe kwa sababu. You know don't you know ni nikaa like akikama pata wasoki fanya the wrong thing. So you always pick us wote. Siku ule mse una slap. Ndio wasi waskate. So it was always me man. <laughs> Kikandua sana fa yo. Mbona ni? Kwa mfupi. Yo mse ujue alikuwa ameka mtu ka alikuwa ameka mtu ka ka alikuwa ameka mtu ka alikuwa wala sana kuja chulo ka what you call it was to transfer. Me transfer. Alikuwa mtu ni mpole nini nini? Am behave nini? Aka kidogo kidogo head boy. So mimi nilikuwa ngani kwanza nituko fit na yeye mazi. Wala fasale ni jamaa maybe sijui nini nilimfanyia. Jamaa alikuwa ananibumburusha. So siku moja nimepata na yeye taojo. Kitambo. Hey, mazilikuwa, nilisikia uzito. So I think forgiveness is such a big thing because if you don't forgive people, unyewe unabeba mizigo. So ni realize usiku kumbe ni mimi nabeba hii mzigo. Mbona nabeba hii mzigo? Ni kama samea. Yeye hata probably alikuwa shasahau. Yeye pengine hata akumbuki alifanya hizo vitu zote. Alikurecognize. Of course. Akakusalimia. Siki jana Mungu amekuja amemsaidia. Ndio siku ana kitu. Siku ana kitu lakini inaonekana inaonekana. Eh. Unaje shot baba mazi mimi kucheki mazi. Sasa hiyo siku ndio ilikuwa glad takatifu siku ilikuwa baba shot baba ilikuwa ah. I think everybody before when you when you ukianza muziki or entertainment kuna time yenye unajulikana but like but I, I, I translate it doesn't into, reflect it doesn't reflect as anything yeah. so people wewe yani jina tu ndio gubo but maisha yako tu iko vile vile unakula pale pale 
mm. unatumia macho unafanya nini inakuanga very humbly time so ali recognize alafu ulimkumbusha ama what happened what was the process kumkumbusha i think what what he needs to do ni uzito wa roho yangu ndio ile needs to nilifeel ai and that time mungu eh hey, mungu nisaidie na forgiveness since kwa na baba wa i think it was a lesson for me of course nimekuwa na many other lessons but when you related to high school na bullying yeah. na nini so i remember that moment when poor what was wala nikusameana huko nje okay yeah. so you guys went to the same this girl school with didi mm-hmm. and then mulianza kuimbia hapo ama how did you guys come together so mimi nilikuwa na interest ya kuimba <coughs> from because i was brought up in dagoreti okay oh when you dago so dago but sana nikatoka dago nikiwa dago nilikuwa na ngongo aro sana so dago na ngongo aro so it's the same thing so kono lian so mimi nilikuwa nishaanza sana nikipata na didi didi za Didi is a dope footballer. So in high school Didi was was more of a footballer than a, than a singer. Okay. But tuka tuka kwa mabeste na tuka hit it off. So tuko pata tuko naongea kuhusu muziki kwa hiyo time tulikuwa marapa. So rap ilikuwa exciting. So tuko naongea kuhusu bambu, kuhusu uko flani. Yeah. And that from 1 2006 ndo tulianza kuimba. So tukaza the whole the whole the whole journey ya kubakisha pocket money. Okay. Tunaenda tunaenda studio. Who came up with the name Kelele Takatifo? I think ilikuwa tu sisi. Ilikuwa tu brainstorm. Why why kelele takatifu? Cuz tulikuwa tunataka jina hili saulika. Eh? Tulikuwa tunataka jina hili saulika. Okay. The whole idea was if if you hate hear it once you don't forget it. Okay. So it was like I love your time. Sio kwamba tulikuwa hip hop. Hiyo school ulikuwa unapata kuna msanii alikuwa anaitwa Kunimbichi, Koflani Maumau, Wakamba wawili. So that was the vibe. If you had a name it has to be very it has to be catchy. Invoking. Eh, yeah. I love pia ilikuwa inaingia na muziki yetu because our music was very tulikuwa very loud na tulikuwa very animated okay mm. so ilingia na poa what is your first jam our first jam na didi ku record ilikuwa inaitwa wase komta but our first jam ku hit ilikuwa inaitwa ni mso kulikuwa na kangoma kingine kadikuwa inaitwa twisty tulikuwa tume sample dauti kabaka mm-hmm. atafika na pitana kama sisi tunapenda tunapenda twist sio wimbo tumeitoa ilikuwa poa but imagine hiyo song ilichezwa wapi ili pesa ilipata ya play heavy tafrija <laughs> but si ngoma ya twist why are you shocked bro the twist ilikuwa <laughs> tafrija twist but your time zee unataka ngoma ichezwe the beat na chezo tafrija ah hiyo ingeenda huko na wazi target audience za kuna target audience za tafrija mzee hakuna so anyway hiyo ndio refai na mkupata azi but the second song ndiko inaitwa ni mso na holy dave ilikuwa kali. Ni mso, ni mso. Yeah. Ni mso. So hiyo ndio hiyo ndio ilianza kutufanya tujulikane because Holy Dave was huge. Eh, Holy Dave was big and yeah. nicest guy ever. Hani. Holy Dave alikuwa like chilled. Eh, yeah, ana maneno. Watu America wananga nini? Only supporting like ali to support sana na kutuchanua. Holy Dave alitu alitu Oje sasa mimi sio mimi ni boy mtaani. Holy Dave ana ako na thinking nyingine very like apart from kukwa msewa uptown uptown alienda shule like akona masters mimi napata na yeye kwa anafanya masters so manzi zile mtu anani alipata na holiday akifanya masters alikuwa i think chuka alikuwa anafanya masters au alikuwa na master degree kwani how old is the guy i don't know but si kitambo sana i think alikuwa anafanya degree i'm not sure but throughout our relationship na yeye amekuwa na degree amekuwa na masters amekuwa so thinking yeah, yake ilikuwa eh, thinking yake alikuwa nani alikuwa anafanya nifikirie <laughs> sana anakuja anamwambia kitu ana, ana, ananirudisha nyuma steps 10 So have you thought about ah <laughs> 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 So you know the Okay. Yeah. But after then so which other song did you guys do and you were like guys this is the one for us this is the one that now give us respect. After you tulikuwa na na ka season ka kupla tu kiasi. So okay. it's like uko uko tu unatoa ngoma unatoa ngoma kama sijididimia achana na mimi tukatoa Diamonde na Chris but tuko tu. Hiyo hey, time ilikuwa hard though. Because mm-hmm. you see the thing is tulianza kuimba tukiwa young tunaanza kuimba tukiwa 1920. So by the time unaanza kutoa hizi songs umeanza miaka hii imeanza kwenda uko 21 uko 22 uko 23 but also that time the market was very saturated it was you remember gospel was like bro it was everywhere nyimo ilikuwa hiyo ndio ilikuwa inzia kina Ecodida Ecodida Juliani yeah. Emoji Jimmy Gate Jimmy Gate kulikuwa na BMF eh yeah. si ndio hey, Jimmy Gate alikuwa ameshika sa industry hivi eh yeah. 
alafu akina DK kwenye beats. Na sio bado akina nani wana Tessa. Bado bado Rington anatoa e, Rington ameshikilia hivi. Eh hey. hey, nyewe mlikuwa UI na Ilikuwa time noma ilikuwa ndio breakthrough. Yeah. Ilikuwa lazima utoe kitu kingine iko crazy. So anyway hiyo time tukakaa for like so kwa like kutoka 2012 13 14 15. So 15 after a lot of suffering na na kuumia tukato <laughs> Jusa tunaumia because acha kwa unao kianza ukianza yeah. mzazi ana mama kupea. Wewe ni mtoto wewe uko 19. Yeah. But ukifika but the time uko 24. So when uko 24 kwanza mother ame ame pass. Maisha yeah. tu ngumu. So hiyo ilikuwa the, the last song tulikuwa like ah, tutoe tu hii song. Ilikuwa inaitwa itakuwa ngori. Eh song tukaitoa hivi. Itakuwa ngori. Hiyo sando ilikuwa after after ni mso that was the other big moment. Na sasa this was bigger because the song became a smash national hit. Yeah. So you have it opened so many doors mpaka tukaenda America mpaka tukazunguka. Unajua kuna ngoma ine za hit. Mpaka ujue kumbe siko na jua Nairobi because unaanza kujua kuna maeria mingi Nairobi ujua haki. Unaona mkutano uko like kumbe Nairobi na kwa kana place more bibi. Kuna zile kuna nyama chome na zisho mavi bibre. Ah acha niko na Kenya unaona ya Kenya eh una Buddha. Hiyo sasa itakuwa ngori was like the thing Buddha. Hiyo ilikuwa ni ngori. Hiyo ilipuka buda. Uko like kama juu. Mpaka majuu buda. Tulipata America na so how did I get here? Mimi ndege yangu ya kwanza kupanda ever in my life ilikuwa kwenda America. Eh, hey, sikupanda sijui ya TLD nini. So niambi uko ndani ilikuwa na kama kama Sofia in London. Niko sijipanda tiki. Niko karibu kukataa chakula. <laughs> Unaweza didi mani hapo yamezuba hapo kanda yangu. Ilikuwa noma. Mndeke mara ya kwanza alikuwa na America. Ah ilikuwa noma. Bude ilikuwa noma. Mlikuwa pekeenyu. Tuko pekeenyu. We na didi. Eh mimi na didi. Mumengedhia tu. Tumengedhia bude. Bora dishi na leo mkolivia. Eh alafu tunafaa. Alafu hata tunafaa twende. Kwanza ilikuwa noma because ile place tuko na land. Atuko tuna land ati tuchukuliwe na mseko ya airport. Tuna land alafu si wenyewe tujipeleke place nyingine tupande basi. Unasema nini wewe? Ngoja mkitoka Nairobi. Eh. Kuna mtu aliyopea pep talk. Eh kuna msi hata kupea. Eh, Mlimuuliza nani huyo? Mlimuuliza we ndege kuna endaje ni nini? Wanaweza soma mabali wa park mwende mko join ni nini? Ah na hizo. Amuko ah, na pep talk. Unaona kwa movie naye anakupea pep talk sasa. Umulika tu si tumejua man. Ah eh so unajua pia si tu kuna watu wengi sasa hiyo wamepanda ndege wamenda America oh, yeah. well, around, no, but, eh. What was the kwa hii flight? Eh. The shocking thing that happened ama kitu kile kushtua ukasema eh. Was there anything? Maybe turbulence, was there turbulence? Was there I don't know. Amir kwa too smooth. Wale wale kwa smooth. I think siko na jam sana na simama at some point and as mama piga round kwa ndege. So because you know nini. Wana sana. Wana sana sika. Because ni kama tunasimama simama nini wale. Because ya. Wala na Kuna mali ndege na fuko huko juu sasa nikai na cruise. So sasa hiyo wasione seat belt ile light inaenda off. So unaweza tembea. So like me most of the flight me got to ya niko to like stay kwa mka hapa. Nikamkuta ndege. Nikamza na chukua kiti yangu unajua. Fala tu. Ko fala. Aya, mkafika buli land wapi? To land Washington DC. Eh eh alafu kwa toka Washington DC hadi place naitwa Tennessee. So mnaambiwa endeni kwa stage mtafute basi. Eh so ndio na place pale inaitwa Union Union Station. Sasa hiyo place ni busy mbaya. So tunafa tuchukue taxi. But the funniest thing tumefika hivi. Tume 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 tumechukua taxi. Taxi kumbe manze jo ni Somalia manze. Tuko like hasa huko huko pia. Era to be. Aye. Eh so at least you I think you to be cuz I'll come to East Africa. But just sasa so I could like ah you guys man so I'll very nice. Okay. Eh alikuwa very yani it was a blessing. I will show you. Eh akatuambia ah so unaenda tu pale so you guys go whatever you Kenyan. Ah anambia yeye hata hata si hata mimi Kenya nini. So akatu akatu direct akatusaidia. Okay. So but tulikuwa ilikuwa like a culture shock thing manzi. Ilikuwa normal. You are seeing different things you guys just like yo. Eh manzi. Ah uko afuko like yani crap ndio imeleta hapa hii kuimba imba hii. Yeah. Like eh, God anaweza tumia kitu yote. But mlilipwa fiti. Gani hiyo time? Yeah. Wewe mimi nilikuwa bayana alipo Buddha. Niko na niko na jali sasa hiyo. Kuna wana jali muda. Ah hiyo story ya kulipofiti. Hiyo story, hiyo story ya kulipofiti inakuja kuna jamaa amekuja hapa na amesema point nyingine moto sana. Sijuka Usa mko interview before mimi. Yeah. I mean say amempega point nyingine ikani ikani changamsha kile. Yeah. Akasema ukiom yangu peleka expenditure yako less ndio uweze yeah. kufanya vitu mob for free. Yeah. Because ukifanya vitu for free sometimes ndio una learn. 
True. So car for me ex- nilipata a lot of exposure by kufanya vitu zenye I didn't put the money first. Okay. I was like can it happen fast? If it can happen, let's do it fast. Okay. Ama let's we figure out the money later. So kama hiyo time I can't even remember kama tuli make do or not. Na kumbuka tu flight ilikuwa imelipwa na nini na nini but that experience open. Kama kaperform karudi. Eh tukaka huko mwezi eh tulika huko. Hey, Stay for a month. Tulika huko baze unasema nini wewe? Eh hey, buli set. Eh hey, mbaya. Unajua mimi sijai kanyaga America. Mapicha eh sijaenda. For real? Well, I see in America. Ah, tenda tu. Oh, kuna pesa. It's no. a matter. It's a, unajua the thing is eh? Kuna two things. Bas, unaona sa that exact point. You see, wewe kwenda anywhere now. Ile sababu unapiga. Sio sababu ya ni sababu am I making money there? Because any second hauko hapa, yeah. you're losing money. You're losing money. So for you to go anywhere, you find there are things you not, you have not done not because you don't have the money, but it's because you don't have the time. Because any minute to you count. Yeah. So this is when you are young to go there for a month. Ah. Kuni nini wewe unaendelea huko? I'm always thinking uh, say, come here. I'm like I can come for a week. They're like no. You can't come to America for a week. I'm like I can't come for a week. What do you mean? Mm. Mimi nataka nitoke Tuesday. <laughs> Nifike Wednesday. Mm. Nifanye shughuli na Saturday nitoke. Sunday niko hapa Monday niko live. Mm. But I'm ama, no. ama unless unless you get unless again it has to make money mm, yes. so if a very tight kama ufanye upange like very elaborate tour yeah. then you'd have to go but then wana sasa ndo nakwambia mali task to make sense ni ati hata wewe ukisema unaenda huko for a month you have to record shows once so kama so, nifanye huko yes. so this is to young there. people like ukiwa like, yeah, like young, the, yeah if you are young do the most man minimize expenditure um, increase exposure yeah. like do as many things as you can like wacha kukaa tu cuz everything unaanza kuambia ukiwa mjanga ati hey, kila kitu lazima ulipwe kila yeah. kitu lazima ulipwe anakupea homa jana see sometimes enda tu learn kitu yeah. that skill inaweza kupea do this time when you guys are doing all things with Didi man mm. until now mm. what do you think has been the difference in the gospel music industry mm. because according to myself i've seen there's been a slower buzz mm. like back then bro like songs hit songs were gospel songs yeah, yeah. Size hit songs ni genge ton watu wanaimba juu ati juu na naacha pomu mwaka babangu wa notice ngine juu napenda bangis juu i'm just like yo me i listen to some songs i cringe like yeah. in my house there ain't no genge ton me yeah. ban my house my kids know yeah. there is no genge ton because yeah. the what they say and the things they say i'm just like yo but back in the day ilikuwa ngoma ya kwanza jimmy gate ya pili sijui nani juliani nini emoji nini makelele takatifu oh yeah. dk kwenye beat nani ringtone yeah. like it was a buzz right now it's a bit different yeah. what do you think the situation is why is that i, I don't think i can put a finger on it kabisa yeah. but what i can say is that um, there are things that ilikuwa ina kuna okay kuna kuna kila kitu kwa na seasons right okay. na tumego through a lot of seasons as gospel music and as a gospel music industry yeah. of course wase ku exit mm-hmm. that's an issue yeah. um, of course you it, it affect because guys are like some guys are going to lose faith okay. investors guys were investing supporters they they are iffy they are like hey do i support these people are they are they are they legit so say una pata the big question everywhere ni kila mtu are you legit are you legit or not yeah. so a lot of things happen that brought a lot of doubt two things the second thing is imagine trends man always kuna a lot yenye iliendelea in terms of even for the music and entertainers kama sasa you na realize even when it comes to comedy and whatever kuna kuna shift ya online ileta a lot of things zenye a lot kushikanisha like if you didn't catch it ikakuwa whatever so i feel like there there are some there's a lot of gospel guys that haven't gotten like um a hang of this online thing and how to actually hack it that's the other thing but of course kuna a lot of challenges that went kuna a lot of things that died um that were supporting and showcasing gospel music kuna to really happen but gospel music kitu naambia wase it's up and gospel music to kuna challenges not gospel music as a whole oh, yes okay. because when you talk about luo gospel kamba gospel kikuju gospel all those things if you go to the trending to the trending page on youtube every week you'll find some random um not some random but you'll find 
uh, tons of gospel music that maybe uh, but the thing is sisi was urban to tulipigwa na yo um shida kubwa because yeah. of a lot of things that happened so and we've been trying to keep the boat afloat because to know for sure hiyo season ya ku, ya kuchachisha inakuja na imekuja so kulikuwa na a lot of challenges but we're getting there we're okay. getting there na pia hata kulikuwa na wasi wengi wenye walikuwa ma legend waliacha tu muziki like that so the new generation yeah. kuna wasi kwa new generation wakaishia and then a lot of legends just stop singing wakaacha tu do you so think, no, your, your balance ni hard. Do you think it's because music does not pay? It's not a lucrative thing. Ama do you think music is lucrative in Kenya? I think music pays, man. I think music pays. You see, as any other thing, if you ask me, it doesn't pay as much as it should. There's so mm. many there's so much money that is lost yeah. in between. So much money that should get to the artist that doesn't get to the artist. But there's there's there is some money that comes. And I guess if artists are wise in investing the money, managing the money well, okay. there's money. Because you, you have artist friends. Can you say that thing truly, Kabisa, who music doesn't pay? They're broke. <laughs> All of them? Yeah, the ones that I know that have money didn't get it from music. They got it from? Other businesses. Did they get some money from music that they invested in other businesses? Or they got it from other businesses? All of it. I don't think so. Because, you know, I, I also have an events company. And yeah. I know how much we pay artists, how much we are paid to do different things from... Mm influencing to just hosting to DJing, MCing, singing, whatever. So and artists are like, at at the least, at the yeah. least paid. If you look at setup of events, yeah. artists are normally like, they're done like a by the way. Mujo, even myself, mujo. I even get sometimes call for an event. Someone negotiates, then you get to the venue. You look at the dome tent, you look at the cake, you look at the decor, you're like, are you mm. mad? But you don't, you know, we don't have a budget, you know, you're like, why are you looking at it as a by the way? Okay. So if you look at it and you know the frequency of jobs, the way we do it, mm. you're like, artistry alone in Kenya might not sustain you the way you want. Me, I think, I think that narrative, there's no music, there's no money in music. I, well, I, 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 there is, I, but I won't, I won't, I won't, I won't say, I won't say there's no money in music. Yeah. Me, I'll say, there's more money, whatever. And then the other thing is, there's more money. I think for an artist, you should we should look at it more as like entertainment, like the whole of of all of it. So, I think maybe me from where I speak, maybe there's some privilege because me I can do MCing, I do I like I mix I mix these things. I can do activations, I can do whatever. So I don't only perform music, but I do all these things. But if all you do together, all those things, you can all together. So, yeah. but the music itself, I me me me, kuna pesa ni mechi kanamzeki. So I'm like, why should I sit here and lie and say kuna pesa kwa mziki? Okay. Maybe sio ile yote inafaa ku, kunifikia. Cuz yote yake inafaa kunifikia. Hiki mm-hmm. tutunge kwa tuna record kwa penthouse yangu, ningekuita. Ngombe <laughs> sikujangi hii side. <laughs> but kuna pesa mingi na ibio. Na I think watu wanatuibia ndio wanasema pesa iko kwa mziki. Yeah. Ndio watu wache ku focus on eh wase 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 fuata hiyo money trail. Sio nimetoa ngoma lakini pesa ikunanga so we move. But What's the largest amount you've gotten for music? I can't say once, that. once of like I, ca- I can't say that, but why? me shika pesa. No, like once of two, like you say kuna yeah, time, shika me shika. Pesa me, God I provide. How much? God, I will say ma. So kwa shame na God. No bina. Sini blessing ya God. Aya. But who perform kwa stage? How what much is the Kama some music, if you're really honest, eh? Or sanyo na fako honest, like pesa mingi kwa kwa, maybe performances. Performances is kuna domo. Mm-hmm. So if you're, if, you're a, if you're a good performer, and you get booked a lot because yeah. that's the other thing kuna you can be a good recording artist and maybe you're not a good uh, performing artist okay because when a client is if you if, again you said about your agency thing is that when you book artists you're not just booking big songs all the time you're booking guys who actually come and do the gig so i think let's be honest puta kuna watu unajua wana pigo big checks huko nje na performance ya mziki like let's not like let's not we, like i'm not you can't even ask you your narrative every day mziki ina do ina do ina do wewe wewe at at same this last weekend and this last weekend uh, uh, this last two weekends kuna watu unajua melala na pesa poa sana kwa mfuko like big checks from companies i know yeah. but I'm pesa inatosha kununua it is that it's 2% mm. if you look at artists 2% are living their life mm. in kenya mm. the other 98 about 90 hawajui wako tu Mm. about 8 ki, wanapataka kitu mm. unaona kwa month anaweza yeah. pataka so unaona yeah, yeah, yeah. kwa month yeah. so. i think i think that's true eh? what i think ukweli when you say soma tu kweli unapata hiyo funnel iko kuna mali ukifika ndio ni experience yodo yes hapa katikati kuna kidogo hapo katikati alafu hapa chini hakuna but mimi nasema kitu kingine pia tuacha kikuongea kuhusu muziki na the urban thinking wewe unajua hawa sanii 
wakamba na wasafiri yeah. na waja buda we ni we unajua aswa ni mba wahangla buda aswa kipula papa <laughs> we have ohangla friends of mine who are booked from wednesday till sunday every week until next year june yes so me i'm like every time cuz i interact with so many guys from cuz i think kuna the uptown side na kuna swanaimba like the other like wanaimba wanaimba na their native language those guys who sing with their native languages and i talk to them but that those guys are making money so Events, when we say when we talk about let's talk, let's know what let's know to kusema urban music okay kusema kuongea kuswizi vitu let's know na pia urban music kuna do yeah. so i can say let's not generalize things so that when we generalize things in Amanisha what are you saying so kama sasa hii nani ana kusikiza si tai kujaza majina but kuna mse kuna artist msapi ana ana sikiza hapo kama muziki ina pesa na sema nini sasa hii wako member kwa hapo member ile ile hapo hapo member kwa seven bedroom yeah. amepanga hapo nje TX anashindwa mnasema muziki ina pesa nini hii yote nime buy na muziki yeah so kuna do Depends it's only that on... what can, can we sit sisi what it down ama when we meet can we share can, can tunaweza we can never share guys are too selfish Mm. The ones who have the fucking formula mm. they never share with the others. Yes. But two, kuna two things which I'd like to say. Kuna the guys who don't like uh, sharing the working formula and the guys who don't like asking. True. The guys who think they True. know. So at a person who's starting comedy will come and meet Obina but in his head anafikiria yeye ni mnoma kuso Obina kuliko Obina. So he's kiza Obina. So first of all it's funny. So go like where where <laughs> we been going around for all these years na kukosa kuwa funny so yeah. kwa like wewe si basi wewe basi kama wewe ni funny kumliko unafa kuwa mbele kumliko so <laughs> you know like it's it's a lot of thinking but even the bible talks about people kupenda cancel so i'm like two things the people who know where money is gotten and how to make money should 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 be should be easy to give this knowledge so that as idea yeah. say and the guys who are coming up should yeah. listen to the guys who are already there because kama mse ameko hapo for 10 years 5 years There's something they There's know something that they you know. don't know. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Where? Your story pesa imekuwa fact. Sawa, sorry bossy. Wewe una make do kwa hii. Hapana. Ni juu sasa unaambia nini wasa? Umse anataka kuanza muziki sasa una mshow. No, no, no. It's normally good to paint a picture so they have an idea. By telling them there's trust no money. Me, when you're starting, trust me. Bro, mm. we no even, even in MC. Mm. You know, listen people have done the whole thing. Like I started MC kwa club, my road show hizo activated hizo via tuna bay, via tuna bay. Those ones dancing on road zote. Mm. If you see him as a corporate MC now and mm. I can easily say give me this amount to do this, I've earned my stripes. Yeah. Someone is starting to dance. Bro, mimi na MC ni mazi. Hakuna makazi nini unaambia. But I'm like if if we if, we give, if the narrative is me I'm I'm pro I'm pro positivity. Positivity. Where I'm like if we say let's say this There's money there's some money in music but there could be more money if the government did this if guys did this okay if if the middlemen did this so come what about there's some money there's some money it's not enough money at ile tunza sema at whatever because i'm yeah. like i hope everybody can just eat in their own whatever especially in the urban music like i hope even say say so people don't have to suffer for too long because i think sometimes say kianza yana suffer for too long bana so kuna wengine hata u give up uh So kabla ufike mahali wanze ku earn. So I think there's some money, but I'm like there could be ma- let's let's be like there could be more money if. Okay. If 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 the guys in between uh, the boss and the artist could stop kukata pesa yote. If the government could open up more avenues and support. Yeah. If there are certain things, if the tax in that all happen up like if we just say there's no ma- so what, we, what are we saying? There's no progress there. <laughs> what, are we, you. what are we saying? Aya. Eh. Waja ni changamushe maneno kidogo. Eh. What is your take on the people who gospel artists when you squeeze wanafanya love songs? Msevile atongozo na God mase. Bible inasema you shall know them by their fruits. Okay. So whatever you say, whatever you do, it's okay you do it. Tutakujua na matunda. Mtu changanya kidogo. Eh. <laughs> Mtu changanya kwa matunda hapo. Umesema <laughs> gospel music could do love songs. No me I know but now there's some But it's like I will know them by their fruits. Yeah. You see, if you plant two identical trees, right? Yes. You might get confused in the beginning. But when those trees, when it's a season for those trees to give to, to give birth, to give oh, no. forth fruit, you'll know which tree is which tree. Yeah, so anybody can say anything. But when time when that time comes to draw unimpera, unimchongwa. And that's what the Bible says, you shall know them by their fruits. So people tell you different things. Okay. People say that people can come to tell you that you because maybe there's an allegation that has come up and has come up earlier but within time tunakuwa tunajua ah kumbe ulikuwa na lia fake wewe yeah. so even when you say guys say hey, I'm a gospel artist and I do this 
it's cause of this, it's cause of that. You shall know that after me mwenyewe, you shall know me by my fruits. Okay. Well. Wacha tungoje matunda. Mkiona mtu ana na watermelon. <laughs> Tamu kama hii ya miale, utajua, utajua. Yeah. Mm. Speaking of miale, you can also get to advertise on the show. If you have a product, tuko na matunda zako, uko na nini zako. Whatever it is that you're doing, you can get a chance to advertise on Obina TV, on Obina Show Live. When you're doing this show, unataka kweka matunda zako hapa, unataka kufanya nini hapa. tunaweza changamuka nazo zote. Hebu niweke ile namba hapa ndio hiyo. Unaona hiyo namba hapo that's the email. address that you can get to send uh, your ad there to me nikona advert flani nataka moja kikuja next anakunywa hiyo mchungwa yangu hapo mimi naweza lipa nikaitua hapa mtu akifanya zoni na kaatu hapa unataka kulipuka hapa yenye uko na pesa kwa gospel ni kweli hawa sani wa gospel wanakafunga na uza sura una but it is possible Tunje nafanya because we have live audience eh. naambia watu kuja kaa kama watch eh. so ya movie pole tunaongeza audience pole pole so unakaanga pale lakini kamera kipan eh. inakuchapa uso mtu akicheka ha ha wende na kurecord eh sio eh alafu na tuna kando eh watch eh. anauza sura tuma email tuma email hapo kwa hiyo number and then tunafanya mambo yetu nice, nice, nice. because now we also have a few uh, at a few a few people a few people that have decided to come on the show number one, where we are is miale mm. umeonja hiyo Tamsa. Na after hii nataka ukule. Yes, yes, yes. Sasa nataka uone miale ikoaje, alafu kuna jamaa hapa wanaitwa eh, House of Maji, nataka uone wanafanya nini, watu wanachimba boreholes, maybe you want to eh, chimba a borehole, unataka ku purify maji yako, au unataka kubaizo ma mashini, au unataka tu ku, ku bottle your water, they do that all the way for you. And then finally, I'll also be able to tell you about the guys who are celebrating the call Nine and Beyond kumi bora. You know it's been a uh, 10 months. So, saa hizo wanafanya safari nataka kwenda kufanya zip lining na wame partner na mimi naenda wapi the forest i'm very afraid of heights so i want to do zip lining and i want you to go with me tunafanya carpooling una kama gari yako na watu wako mimi na kama gari yangu na watu wangu tuna drive na fika huko tunafanya zip lining tunacheza biking archery ni tunakula alafu tunarudi so i'll just tell you about them but for now check out me ale There you go that is house of magic so maybe you want uh, to find out something about water from the bohol unataka kuchimbia bohol unataka ku purify magic unataka ku transport unataka ku package the other people talk to but for now i need to focus on this that is a kumibora road trip to the forest with myself so i'm going over there partnered with a uh, nai and beyond nai and beyond is a tour and travels company so if you want to travel anywhere talk to nai and beyond.co.ke they'll take you in nairobi and beyond other countries other cities you can get to enjoy but on this date 
that is on Saturday, the 11th of November, I'm going to try zip lining for the first time. And after this, I'm even thinking of bungee jumping, but hapo kidogo, but skydiving, sana sana naona, maybe I might try. I'm very afraid of heights. So I'll be going. So talk to your friend. If they have a car, you guys can come together. You can hire a car. Um, kuja ponya, that's the amount. Unalipa 7,840 per person. Kuna lunch hapo ndani. Kuna archery, kuna bike riding, kuna zip line. Tunenda uko. Tunani kama team building yetu mwaka ikisha. Alright? So uh, call the number on the screen. And then niweze kukupata kuwa na hapo. And you, you have a business. You want to get to advertise it on Obina uh, TV or Obina Show Live. You know how to get us. Send us an email. Let's change it. You don't have any you. Do you want to know yako? Moji short, Baba. So, son. Tire, ne, 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 ne. Beka, beka, bam. Ah. Bono mwile chana na didi, man. Maisha tu. Maisha tu. What do you mean, maisha tu? You guys were like a power couple. Me, I saw you guys stop seeing with Didi, man. Power couple lead you. Power couple lead you. No, but you guys were like, you know, you're looking so good together. This is on to the life. Akunaga. Akunaga. Mambu, mambu happen to. Mulia chana, Didi, man, Didi, akata kuimba. Ana imba kwa sana. Eh, ujasikia, ujasikia nini? Ngoma na ngoma tuna benachi juzi. Eh. But toka hiyo time wa chana, ume tongo maka 15, ya metongo maka mbili. Okay, see 15, kama more like 20. Fifty. Yes, fifty. Mm. Uh, album. since then. Album uh, ya kwanza kuna ngoma I think ilikuwa na thirteen. Thirteen. Na kulikuwa na singles in between. Mm -hmm. Ingine ilikuwa na sita. Na inmetu ingine ilikuwa na tisa. Na singles in between. But mm. amekuwa kitu mziki. Yo si, yo yeah, but we is not as loud as the both of you are or as you are now. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. Mafanzo wake wana, wana msikia. Okay. Hey, well, sometimes in um, maybe two my fans work on Amskia, but okay. I think he's doing a good job, an amazing job. Guys, we check out what he's yeah. doing now. What he's doing with Akina Akina Jabidi, we Katik, they're doing an amazing job. Okay. Um, I think for me, kila mtu kwa tuna na pati yake. Okay. Uh, mimi makuwa tuni ki, mimi najua tumu fanya mambo, mimi nafanya ngadu mambo yangu in my own way, cause mimi najua. Uh, kuna sana like Moji the music, kuna sana like Moji the personality, yeah. so maybe sometimes we nazo a bit loud. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> beat. Beat. <laughs> you say big things come in small packages. Hey, a beat. Hey, I saw hey, you hey, making hey, noise hey. for, for Chesa Gospel. Hey. I loved the idea. Hey. That's your, your idea. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Your, own, your own thing, like you're hey. doing everything. Yeah, yeah. Una GMC event yako? CMC, brother. But it's my... It's uh, it's it's an event. Yeah. Um. It's a movement that came from a from the EP. My second EP, my second now major project was Chesa Gospel EP. Okay. In 2021, ikaza Chesa Gospel Festival na ikaja Chesa Gospel tour. Okay. Kwenye Chesa Gospel Festival tulifanya tao, tukena tu kafanya Chesa Gospel Islando, tu kafanya Chesa Gospel Kitengela, na inendelea tu. The one for Kitengela, bro. Sindole mwa ilinyesha. Maze. I saw it. I was like, this guy. Who's there? Kona confidence in giving. Crazy. And then kuna teams uliko meva. Eh hey, man, kwa moto. Imagine. <coughs> Imagine kuwe puka matope na hizo teams. Miliona ni kula gumu. Ya wangu ni bebo wa kele toka stage. Ya wangu ni tuwa feshi empire. Actually, ni kani li bebo. Ito feshi empire hui ni sort mba. Yeah. So ilikuwa, 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 ilikuwa jani. How has it been though? I know it's not easy. It's not easy. Planning that whole Especially thing. Especially coming from a point ya. Uh, Where you are the, when you are the artist and umezo ya kuitua. Mm. And then now organizing your own things. It's, it's another thing altogether. Of course, you mm -hmm. have a team, but if you're the leader... Uh, because you're the only one with a vision. Yeah. You want this like this. Cause it, that. Yeah, because you unaweza kuwapo kona like guys. But, atu kitu mawasea hapa uh, mapema, eh, ati wambia, and then you set up. Kika mapa, lazima tutaka kuchini. Yeah, unaka mpiku kuna jemo. Tuza. Kina mpika kama mpiku jemo, mwoni mba wajia wiko maji. Eh, see, and it's not because those guys don't get it. Yeah. But you are the one who has the image. In your in your head, which mm -hmm. so sometimes we bring it out. It's it's a difficult. So for me, it's been a learning journey how to organize gigs. Okay, so organize gigs. Unaza kwa na grace at the event organizers, man. Unaza kwa na name a kilo. Kikuramba. Okay, man. No wonder. Kikuramba. Unajua. So first of all, you think about the permits. Yes. You think about the different things that you have to buy. The weather. How is it gonna be? Now you get everything right. You get everything right. The weather. The weather pulls up. Yeah. Like, what's up, man? Yeah, I'm not going to be okay. So, I'm sorry. You should have supplied guys with umbrellas. I'm just going to go to the house. I'm 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 going to go to
kwa juasi we tell you the business of shit is very lucrative well bro like There's i no even that's like when you i know my toilet nikikitumia una enjoy sana na sema eh also get to poa amu hata na complain is it also let us kwa poa but when you are organizing your own gigs and you have to hire hizo vitu like like sikwatu ende tucho kwao like na watu wabibi wa kam i got to a case in the home so kuna mtu ni organize gig na kule kwa na la public toilet just next to it go like how in the pale You are evil. <laughs> you are very evil. But and anyway, God is watching you. <laughs> and I think that's the other thing. I think yeah. most most like now the transition of either getting a team as an artist yeah. to be able to whatever or you yourself learning how to do some things. Moving from just a performer to a manager to managing yeah. stuff. Yeah. Yes, that's, that's a very important transition. I even saw you went to Uganda bro you shut it yeah, down. Bana. Thank God. Yeah. Yeah. Thank God. Ilikuwa sana. I think tumekuwa tiki for a long time you, you that's the other bit and i think from and maybe it's good e to record it back up is that the other thing about now gospel when gospel is not coming back we just don't want to come back and when it's coming back to its glory not even coming back when it's coming to scale it, I, it, it, I, my prayer is that it's not just kenya is that now to some sasa kenyan gospel artists a continental a global stars worldwide yeah that's the other thing you will bring we bring god for So okay. for us going for me going to Uganda performing that event Lukoa Kololo it was one of the most iconic Kololo uh, is yeah. huge Kololo yeah uh, Kololo, Kololo Independence yeah. Ground so it was yeah. crazy man yani unasema ah yani and they were singing your songs eh yeah, mazi kalala tongonang dang bang my energy zangu nini hapo wana songa nayo kwa kwa poa sana kwa kwa poa sana so can't wait to go back to Uganda open Maybe. up Tanzania hivyo hivyo hebu talk Uganda. talk to the talk to the sebos and then yabos yeah. much love sebos Hey bana, short baba, I'm still coming for my chicken in one day. Yeah, yeah man. It's gonna be big. And your chicken in <laughs> in one day. Yeah. It's a place in Uganda, man. But yeah. it's amazing. Like uona tunataka kuipeleka level nyingine na even sasa kuipeleka level nyingine na nyingine. Yeah. Yeah. Kuna ingoma yako. Mm. Bro, I love the production, the instruments in this song, the beat, the way it starts. Bro, how did this song come about? Bro, I listened to this song I'm just like Obina where were you? Why did Moji have this beats? <laughs> Why did Moji have this idea? Why did you think before? Why did you find this producer? Mm. Bro, everything in this song is from the beat to the video to what? Mm. How? It was who came up with the so idea? There's a guy, you got an idea you chorus, but there's a producer of mine and it was Seville. Mm-hmm. Seville is crazy, man. Seville is crazy like in terms of like creativity anafanya kitu zile uko zile za jo eh like ana catch the vision so niko na producers wengi wa brilliant but Seville is one of my of my favorite producers yeye ndo alikuwa na producer pia um Jabidi oh. eh yeah, Vimbada is the one who did Vimbada no, exactly. so that guy is dope man Seville is like when he gets into that zone and aza kufanya kitu uko tu like ai ikitu ni kali so that was highly favored you look you look my last song last year but imekuja kushika poa this year now Eh mara nipenda mbaya Seville. Kuna ngoma nataka kutoa. Eh. It's called Jeshimu. Eh. I was actually writing it last night. The idea just came and then I was like by the I need to do a song just to people to respect themselves yeah, the things that are happening. Yeah. And I was looking for a producer. I don't want to use my producer. I want to use a different producer yeah. for a different vibe. Yeah. Then I want to get a writer as well. Yeah. So I have the concept yes but now I'll be like we are bro. Eh, now we have to execute this thing eh. because I want it to sound very eh. I think I'll go for it. Okay. <laughs> highly favored mm. 626000 views mm. and yeah you are highly favored yeah, thank god man. bro you are highly thank favored god. thank god so right now new ep yeah 
is out. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ngoma tisa inaitwa boy wa kanisa. Boy wa church. Ameka mkuchachisha. Uh -huh. Video out na nimepo collaborate na jamaa wa Muhanji, nime collaborate na JPD, nime collaborate na Evening Wanjiro kwa hiyo EP. So, ni ku try tu ku kupea mafans wangu enough content. I've kwenye. seen. Yeah. You've put a uh, so kuna after church. Mm. That's with Muhanji. Yeah. Is Ugandan? No, Ugandan no, it's Kenyan, it's Kenyan. Muluya, oh. Muluya wa. Yeah. Mutaona Mutaona ni peke yangu. It's from the EP, same EP. EP yeah. Kiziona eh, zikona rangi same mapo. Chachisha. Chachisha. Chezea buwana. Yeah. Kona. Yeah. Mema. Mama Shiro. Mama Shiro. Yeah. <laughs> Mama Shiro. Wane temba kituka iyo. We unaimama mitu zikini niko zile. The way you twist, you, you, you take. Mina <laughs> lamu. Yeah. 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 Unapotea. Yeah. Pokea Sifa. Evelyn Wanjiro. Yeah. Eh, mema. Eh, doctor after church uh, so this ep how many songs nine 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 songs how many videos are coming out all of them oh most of them most of them are coming most out. of them but we're just crazy ziki zingine zinatolewa visualizers zingine yeah, zingine yeah but the visualizer is a video actually eh, it but works a, like it gives you unajua uto tujina uto tujina tunangupianga excuse ya kufanya kitu enye siyo <laughs> <laughs> like ulikuwa go for an official video haikukaa poa unasema ah kwa nika visualize tu video nakaa video nakaa <laughs> video nakaa yeah. lakini ngoma ikiiti ime hit ngoma ikiiti eh so i think kuna kuna zenye sta get my visualizer kuna zenye sta get my lyric video iko okay. tu tunachachisha tu because now we're in the age of content eh? yeah. um even as artists where ukipata one song una for spin like three times to like yeah. a dance video to like whatever we're in the age of content because now so. Mimi, but you've just told me something very mm, brilliant. Because we niko age ya, tuko age ya content. We niko kwa YouTube space. Yenye ubina ako. Na ubina natuwa video daily. True. So even as an artist with the age of, kama Instagram, the days are gone atuna post picha moja. Na mimi uto post picha moja, uto post uko ukikula maembe, ukiimba, uto post ukifanya nini. So we're in the age of content. So even artists have to become content creators. Bro, you've told me something that I did not figure out. The eh. same song, you can spin it three or even four ways, even eh, five ways. Eh, do a dance one, in eh, visualize any lyric video, eh, in his official video. Yeah, guys who do that, when Jokitambo, guys used to think that unatua lyric video because you don't have money for the video. But see, even when you have the video, unatua the lyric video first, then unatua visualizer, then unatua whatever, then unatua dance video, then unatua BTS, then when you perform Mali live, una record your live, una, then unafanya acoustic version. So kwanza go by key hit. Unaikamua wewe. <laughs> you milk it. Unatoa. Kuna jamaa mboga aliona. Kuna jamaa aliona mboga wanafanya East African remix. West African remix. You move with Spanish it. Spanish remix. You move with it. Yeah. You have to. Si yao ni akina nani? Eh akina wasafi. Wanatoa ngoma hivi. Wameingia na wewe Spanish huko wanafanya remix. Kwanza ikichukua. Kwanza ikichukua. You know when you realize a song has an element of mm. of virality ama has an element of yeah. of whatever. You make sure you milk it kabisa. Oh my baby te amo. Eh, that's the other thing. <laughs> so, which one is your favorite? Favorite song has to be um I think Mema. The song they are called Mema. Mema. Ni furaha kujua. Yesu nani wasia Mema. Eh eh. Yeah man. Adam. Why is why, why why is this song your favorite? Because it's Jeremiah um, 2911 and some that for I know the good plans that God has for me okay. are, are plans to prosper me. Like we uh, imagine if Obina you knew earlier on like way earlier on in your life if it it, it was cemented in your brain that God has good plans for you. Niambia yeah. how many depressing nights unge unge skip unge skip like unge jua for sure like ni kama unge jua for sure that unge fika hapa na jo mali unatafika ni even father yeah. But we go for sure, man. Yeah, but I imagine, imagine scripture actually tells us you should know for sure that God has good plans for you, regardless of what you'll go through. It doesn't tell you that you have to fear machine or whatever, yeah. but He has good plans for you. So I think for me that song. Yesu nani pangia mema Kujua Yesu nani wasia mema Ni furaha kujua Yesu nani pangia mema wasia mema Wewe ya ma Hey hey Kali 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 Ebu nisikie tu intro ya hii mmefanyana nani na Jabidi Na Jabidi
Of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Of course. I go. Yeah, my dad. Yeah, my dad. Of, of course. <laughs> of course, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, let me show you something. Eh. Sasa unta kusikia, imefanya na Evelyn Wanjiru. Eh. Hear the defense. You mentioned a very good point yeah. where you told me that unfortunately there are songs that your kids cannot dance to. Yes. But let me ask you so, and there are guys sometimes they don't understand us when we do some of these songs. But so your kids want to dance anyway. Yes. So if they have to dance, Moji has to be there and Jabidi. True. Now your kids can dance to clean gospel, gospel music, music where everybody in the fa- everybody in the house, yeah. come and say we're going into December, everybody in the house can dance to some songs. True. And unfortunately, you know, you see, only the same, oh, kuna ngoma za safi, ah, watu yonata ku dance ko beats za sahi. Watu yonata ku dance ko ile beat ina in in hit sahi. Hi. So, as much as ngoma za kitambo, tu nasema gazini kuwa safi, watu yonata ki hizo song, watu yonata beat yonye ko engineered sahi, because iko kwa within this time. So, it's important, like, for us, even when we do songs like Mema, to also do tongs, songs kama hizo tafaya na Jabidi na, 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 na the rest, because now we have all these kids, when you, they had, and that's one that's another reason why we say Chesa gospel and we, we we cannot stop doing gospel music because it's no longer about us. Yeah. Yeah. So what we in terms of if we can be a we have to be busy. We do one with the one one or the other. We have to But there's a there's a bigger reason why we do gospel music. Yeah. yeah. There's a bigger reason why we do it, and it's for those kids. Okay. Yeah. This album is there anybody who was supposed to be in it and they are not in it? This EP. ACP no 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 hakuna hakuna kila mtu mwenye kwapa was intended yeah, to be there was intended na kuna mtu mwenye yuko hapa mwenye ilifa kuwe hapa a a cuz cuz kuna cuz kuna another project yenye itakuwa na watu wengine okay yeah. so hiyo ndo hiyo kwanza ni unapambana nayo sana cuz hiyo ndo sana hiyo ndo natafuta watu is there someone that you've always wanted to work with and aujai pata chance unasema huu ni king and nice studio god's will honestly, be done if i'm really honest it's a me what you're also saying that ultimate artist to you shall look up to all your life yeah. for me it was juliani juliani yeah. juliani yeah. Uh-huh. so i total man yeah. so same says same at at, at nimesha try kakata hata siji try but i'm looking forward to the day so you just reach out no it has to be it has to be the day or oh, you you want it to just happen you ni wale watu if god wants it for uh-huh. me ah this is easy tutakuta na two studio no bina iko ni more like i pray I get the idea he need to like this is cuz me oh, the way I collab uh, the way I like collabing me personally if I'm calling you to a collab na penaka kuanza the project sasa ndio the studio tuanze kutafuta okay. wasanii wawili wenye ni wa creative kwa kawili kwa sababu sometimes unatoka mnaweza toka hapo bila wimbo I'm sure you make up here ukuchomba jama moja mwenye ni creative kawa wewe mnaingia kwa studio at clean slate new project utashinda hapo Ora sema sikufanya hivi wengine hivi. Huko kile hivi mnatoka hapo ah mnaanza wimbo inaashika nusu. Naja. Mnaanza rumba ikaweza kani re. Eh, sasa zingine unaanza zile zu work ni niaje niko na idea. Unampea mna build on it. Perfect. Kusha. Hii inakuwa poa. Ukiwa kon kitu hata na msee in mind mko kwa studio ina producer, you more likely to nail it. Well, that's my thinking. That's my thinking. Okay. Although kuna wasi wenye tukiingia kwa studio tunaingia kwa studio tuko na good chemistry kama guardian angel mimi na zingine kwa studio na guardian angel na tutengeneze something from scratch i don't know but it works but mm-hmm. kuna wasi wengine nime try ina kosa ku work so za zingine kuna zingine muta kani kwa na idea hili msia katae but ni kwa na idea okay so kaji yani ni one of them man i can't wait to get that idea nyata mpigia ni mwambie my bro nataka put it out there pia kwa na idea naweza kwa na idea na kwambia moji ni aje but for me yani ule msi mwenye like niko high school niko to like this guy at out of high school hey man do you say like 360 in terms of his packaging um his business acumen yes 
his and his performance his performance Crazy. sasa hiyo ilikuwa so alikuwa like anawa yote unajua kuna ule msemo mwenye anawa yote biza anaipiga fit ya kuna endorsement eh unamwona yeye unamwona sijui na Bob Colimo unajua ilikuwa like umzeja hoja wajo umze kuna nini nafanya umze asikuwe tu like apart from being a good artist akuwa an interesting person yenye wase wengine wenye ni wase wa big kwa ile life anaweza msikiza cuz that's the other thing yenye mimi na ni ilikuwa ni challenge cuz hata sasa unaweza kuwa like a very good artist you know very good artist but umse was can reach in upigana story like interview ngeko ilisha kitambo yeah uko tu like hey thank you so much this has been a bit alive we will see you kumbe ni jamaa wa kuboa hapa unasikia kulia wait life ya ndo ina kupelekaje iko sawa iko fit iko sawa eh tunaenda tu nayo secret ya happy marriage nini secret happy marriage yes baba yes 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 naeka yesu mbele huko nje unaambua kisikiza watu wanakuambia oh mm. sijifanya hivi sijifanya so put hivi. god in it put god in it because what i'm when you teach if you put god in it inamaanisha god will help you to forgive okay god will help you to ad, ad, like we are honest at least kuna mungu at least kwa mungu tunakuanga honest so many god mean kona ishida lakini wasa kuambia sometimes unashindwa kwa so god will guide you me i think okay. the, the whatever for happy marriage is is god at the center of it all Yeah. Okay. That's me. That's it. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much for coming. Miss Jawa, nimeoa nani? Someone una kasirika. Una story za kuna ni una ni akanimeoa. Miss Queen, na 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 ni post ni ki post video wa toy. Ona sema, "Wapi mama yao? Mbona tuni mama yao?" Niko like, "Awo ni mama yao because ayuko." I'm like, "Kill." I'm like, "Wapi mama yao? Mbona tumoni?" I'm like, "Exactly." So una nabia, "Na wewe?" Guys if I never come back to the show you know why. Ilikuwa ilikuwa eh. Wajani kwa kama baba. So kipara ni bado kuna school kuna school only different. Nikiwa kiss. Nilikuwa kota. The one I did the one kneeling down it's fine. Me I was doing celebrities that I like so I'm like let guy, me. Yani, God bless you. But man. you are a good sport. Thank you. Do you know there are some people you do something for them and they take offense. I'm like guys, I'm a comedian. I'm joking. <laughs> you can't take a joke. You know, because my my comedy I don't push the envelope too yeah, far. Yeah. There I know lines. I know yeah, where I can't. Yeah. yeah. But now there are some people are just like Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes you know. Again, yeah. watu no watu. But it's fine. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Naka kama Lwenda, unajua ni kama Grasopo dede. Zinakwanga hivi. Eh zinakwanga na macho kubwa hiyo. Zinakwaje na 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 kijaka? O dede. O dede. Ni o dede tu. Yeah. yeah, it cuts across kijaka Kiswahili and then also mm. English in our day day. You say o day day in English, you know what I'm saying? Ngaka ule jamu uko na host. Wacha kujaja hivi hivyo. Unajua hiyo jamaa anaitwa Eve. Na ni Morio. moji is one of them So show him the love and show the support tell your kids to also listen to more of his songs because unajua wana really thingy sana mimi watu wangu wamekupenda ju wana vidango ni mmoja wao shida ni unakuwa na ndevu ah good night good night god bless you come and like subscribe ah